pull it back to my dry hand. All right, pick that up, cover it, pick this up, cover it, flip it over. Oh, look at that. Cover Chick -fil -A. it. Cover it, okay. I'm gonna pick that up, look at that. Uh -huh. Let's see. Will now I come crusty. off in the hot grease? What? We're gonna do it. I just turned the fire on so I can show you. All right, so you got here. All right, see the beautiful piece, all covered all the way. One more time. Wet here with the wet. All right, I'm gonna pick this up. Shake off any access you got. We're going right in dry, wet into dry. We got to season individually. We're going to make sure. Flip it over, coat it, okay? If I were to drop this in, in oil right now, this process is called dredging, okay? It's a process when you just use just flour on something. When you're making chicken fricassee, when we're doing like making a beef stew and you like have to flour the, the beef, this process is called dredging, okay? This is called the breading process because we have breadcrumbs. But if you stopped right here with just flour, it'd be called what, um, Lee? Fried chicken. It'd be called dredging. What do you mean fried chicken? <laughs> dredging. All right, so we in here again. Wet hand, okay? Chef messed up, I use my dry hand. All right, good. See, I messed up. All right, but is the dredging in. fried chicken? Huh? Dredging is fried chicken, okay. yes. I'm gonna change my gloves because I already messed up my wet and dry hands. If you do mix it up, it's okay to change your gloves. You wanna change your gloves because you don't want any clumps in either one. That'll, that'll, you know, it'll make you have to change the eggs or change the breadcrumbs over faster than you need to. That's why we use two different hands, okay? All right, so I got wet, dry, wet, dry. All right, so good, back on this one. All right, back in there. I like to cover it, okay, cover it. Lightly pack, don't smash. You don't wanna, you know, press the juice out, you just wanna lightly pack. Whatever's gonna stick to the chicken, will stick to the chicken. Whatever's not gonna stick to the chicken will fall off and you want to naturally fall off. But that's why you make sure you bread everything. Okay, so I'll pick it up, boom, see that? Wow, nice and covered. Stayed on there. Okay. Really good. Everything. Right and here. this is how Chick-fil-A does it? This is not how Chick-fil-A does it. They as I said, they don't use breadcrumbs. They use flour. They dredge. But what they do is they have a a buttermilk mixture with oh, their chicken, which oh. allows it to stick more to the chicken. So if you notice, they have a bigger crust on it, all right, and they just heat up to a high temperature, okay? All right, you you two understand what a chef just did here? Yes. Okay, you two are gonna finish the chicken right here, all right? Yes, you are gonna finish doing the parsley, and I have another job for you two, okay? Yes. All right.